Hello and welcome back. I'm Jaren, playing Oxygen Not Included, trying to get every single achievement in this game on hard mode. So dupes are eating twice the amount of calories. They're getting stressed out easily. I'm on an asteroid that is metal poor, so I'm having to be very conservative of what I build with metal. And I'm wanting to do something I've been wanting to do for a while, which is automate this incubator further. I'm going to start with an auto sweeper. Scientist is researching a conveyor loader, which is needed for this whole setup. I'm going to put this right here, and it's important that this does not access this tile, because this is where new eggs are dropped. It's also where, oh, I, I, yeah, that's right, I can't build that yet. It's also where eggs that need to be reprocessed will also be dropped. So I'm going to put an auto sweeper there. I won't be able to build this until I remove the skills from scientists and make them a Metatronics engineer. That's, that's why uh, it's complaining about that little hat thing. That This will need power. This will need some power. So the idea is this is going to sweep eggs that I have processed. When they drop down here, I will no longer need them to go through the floor. This can pick it up and send it down into this room. And this is going to pick up eggs that don't have the lullaby effect and send them up to this room to be processed. Instead of this whole contraption, if you're interested in knowing what the heck this whole thing was, I have a previous episode on that. But I no longer need that bit of it. It's just the incubator that I care about, as well as uh, automation for lights, obviously. I'll keep that. But the rest of this crazy stuff can go. That's gone. This is gone. The power actually automation also is kind of nice, because what that does is if someone leaves the incubator, it's not going to be running all day long. Okay, I am going to find a place. I'm going to choose down here to build another stable. This is going to be for the pips. I'm going to... The reason I'm doing this now is because I finally have another acorn. I'm going to put in a, you know, a station for grooming. I'm going to give them a drop-off. That's where the pips are going to be sent in. I want a place to put the acorn and have the pips plant that somewhere along here. Well, maybe I'll remove these trees. This one doesn't have to be as big as the other ones, other stables. It just needs to, because I only have one tree that's basically just going to feed three pips. So I'll put three pips in here and give it an extra space for at least one more for an egg. Well, so an egg can sit in there and ha wait for a dupe to take it out. So we'll work on that. We'll let scientists do some research. I've got to figure out... Oh, I, I better be pl uh, processing some eggs. So, actually, you can... Uh, normally, I would hide this bit, but I'll show you the pain I go through. Right now, I'm checking to see if there are any eggs that don't have the lullaby effect, or, you know, uh, any eggs that do. There isn't. That actually makes this a little bit easier, because I'm going to select which ones need to be swept. If some of them did have the lullaby effect, I'd have to go one by one, select the ones that uh, don't have it and sweep just those but this is actually kind of nice so i'm going to open this door i'm now going to tell supply i want them to go in here speed things up a little bit stress yeah builder no doubt you're a little bit stressed because they've been they're the only ones that has the ability to dig uh last episode i did that mess and that's supplying me with my base with water along with this as well. Um, so what I'm going to do just before we go any further is, let's see, where is build, what's Builder's schedule? I'm going to match the same schedule that they have right now and just give them more sleep and more downtime. So Builder's currently on break. Next time they're going to get a longer break. I'll give them lots of rest, some bath time. So enjoy some good and well-earned break, Builder. I'll keep you out of that frosty zone for, uh, for a little while anyway. So supply is on their way up. They're going to go... Oh, it's, it's way too far. <laughs> you passed it. 
Oh, what were you doing? You were going up there to... You're, oh, you're dropping chlorine. Uh, yeah, okay. Is that what you're doing? It doesn't look like you have chlorine. Bleach... Oh, bleach... Yeah, of course you do. Bleach stone. That's what I meant. Um, okay, that's fine. That is a high priority task, because I don't want that to drop somewhere and leak chlorine into the air. So now they're in there. They're in this room. They're trapped in this room. I've designed it that way so that I can get them to do tasks and not run around the rest of the base. They can focus just on this room. So right now they're picking up all the eggs that I've selected. That happens to be all of them. But if only uh, I've only selected certain ones, they'd only be bringing up those ones. Essentially all the... <laughs> look at this. <laughs> yeah, they're, I guess I can call them egghead. Um, let's go close the door. Boom, boom. And... It's already set up to process a hatch egg. I'm gonna prioritize on these. Where are we in terms of this, the stable? I plan, I plan to have, actually I put seven, or set eight. I actually wanna have one under just in case uh, there's an egg. It gives a little bit of time to get that egg out of there. Uh, with seven dupes, with, or with seven hatches, that's, uh, that's enough to feed two dupes, just maybe slightly more even. Um, but yeah, so from, actually with this guy, I'm gonna wrangle them and get them to uh, go in there. And now this is full. Any future hatch eggs from this point on is food. That has a little by effect. So I'm gonna click on this. It's gonna remove it. That sensor is dropping it down there. Now I'm gonna temporarily allow them to leave just so that after this, oh, well, it's, it's the end of their day. You know what, rancher, it's, you can, uh, you can take over. So I need this thing wrangled. Rancher has a different schedule. Yeah, no, you're you're filling that up. I'd rather have you wrangle. In fact, until you wrangle, I won't even let you out. So don't think of going around the base and do with something else. Okay, so when that is wrangled, ah, rancher, 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 really. I want you to wrangle or not pick that up. And that's already high priority. There you go. Thank you. Thank you so much. Drop that in here. And now that's the proper. That's the proper or, or the number of uh, hatches I decided to to put. So as I was saying, any future ones. Now where are you going? You're going in there. No, I I want you back in here. I'm gonna trap you in there. Now we're gonna process some eggs. So we'll do, if there are any hatch eggs, we'll do those first, because those have more meat. More meat in a hatch than there is a pep. The only nice thing about the pips is it's free resource to feed them, a tree just grown in the wild where you have to give material for the hatches. Da, da, da. So we're giving this thing a hug. We're removing it. Oh, I missed it. If you missed that button, uh, I did create this system here to drop that down. That's also used to bring up eggs that have been processed. So scientists looks like they're nearly complete, which is exciting. That's going to give me the conveyor loader. Now I'm going to try to do some time. There we go. Conveyor loader's in hand. Let's do another egg. And while we're doing that, I don't think I can multitask. Actually, I'm going to put this on pause. We can build this. Now I need still a Minitronics engineer somewhere in the base. So I'm gonna put it right here. Technically, technically I don't want this system eventually. So I could have put it right there, saving me a tiny bit of metal. I could, actually, or I could change that later. I won't, I won't worry about it right now. It's gonna give me such a big benefit. I don't really care about the ex extra use of, of uh, the metal. And I have produced some of my metal from with the metal refinery. Let's actually just bring that up. I'm showing my aluminum ore. I would not mind just showing just the plain old aluminum itself. 200 kilograms. Okay. That's just perfect. Scientists, now, you have enough skill points. Check that. Uh, I love, I wish Builder had this. They probably will have a skill point given to them really soon. 
Um, but I really, it just needs to be done because they're a quick, a faster builder. But let's just go with sign disc. They need to, oh, oh, I removed. You know what? I will, uh, I was going to put them through a skill scrubber. I used to have one here. I don't anymore. We'll put it right there. That's going to give it light access. Oh. And sure. Giving a hug. That's going to drop. If I slow, oh, I did notice that. Processing another egg. I can see a builder at the same time destroying that equipment. That's good. Another egg is being dropped in. Okay, so I need a station to remove skills. This is going to remove the skills from scientist skill scriver. Put that right there. Now, this is a heavy usage uh, item. It would require, I'm not going to do research at the same time. I'm a little bit nervous about overloading my circuit. So I'm going to actually temporarily very much want to remember to turn on some of the stuff. Let's disable this as well. Uh, not uh, not high on calories, but you know what? Let's let's get uh, let's get after some of the pips that have hatched and go with that plan. Actually, I I, sh I shouldn't uh, I shouldn't do that just yet. Enable that building because this is I'm not this this building's not actually built yet. Kind of jump the gun there. Let's re-enable that building. Oh, and then back over here. I need to remove this. I walked away, so I'll have to press the button instead of getting automation. Making my life just that tiny bit easier. Going through another egg. And I'm kind of showing this process. I was hiding it somewhat in the other videos. Just because it's kind of painful to watch. It's... Trust me, if this is painful to watch, it's painful to play. Uh, cycle after cycle after cycle. That is why I'm so excited to get... Oh, supply is in there. So, you know what, Rancher? You're probably going to on, want to go on break sometime soon. So why don't you, we get you... I would, okay, excellent. You're off. Change of the uh, guards. Dropping an egg. Doing another egg. Putting this in, da, 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 da. sometimes screwing up such that I have to press that little button, you've seen that. I'll plan the next bit of this automation, which is a conveyor loader, which is going to send eggs right here and let them hatch. Alright, and then do another egg. Do, 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 do. Giving that a hug. Is the skill scrubber ready? It is not. Very much waiting for that. Because no one can actually build any of this Metatronics equipment. Keeping a close eye. And I'm going to give a big pay raise to the dupe that decides to build that skill scrubber. No takers. An extra break for uh, the dupe that wants to. No? Scientist? <laughs> Fair enough. Um, yeah, it, it's just endless processing eggs. This is certainly not a forever thing. I guarantee. I would not be playing this game if this meant. If this is the only way to survive, I'm doing this for the carnivore achievement. Um, yeah. The neat thing about it. I mean, you could set yourself up in a situation where this was needed. But the cool thing about this game is. There isn't just one source of food. You don't have to eat meat. You can do other things. There's plants. You may not get the carnivore achievement. Maybe you don't care about getting achievements in uh, your playthrough. Last few playthrough uh, playthroughs I have, I've ignored the achievements. But it's kind of fun to challenge yourself with uh, this. Is that all of them? No, there's still so many. A little bit. Oh, 23,000 calories? Yeah, hold on, hold on. Let's... We don't need that anymore. There was... There must have been a herb... Oh, no! And there's still a lot of mealwood to be given. Yeah, let's shut down that, uh, that system. Another hug. Another egg. Should be getting a lot of meat. 
in the next. I'm just predicting with this many eggs, and I'm getting the lullaby effect added to them all. I'm going to be getting a lot of meat. A lot of the dupes are uh, up running around, just trying to generate power. I do have this machine running. Um, I don't have circuitry issues with that because that's on heavy watt where, where this one would. But, um, let's just do another egg. Oh, okay. There it is. So I'm going to get scientists to go in here. I'm going to start to turn off some things temporarily. Let's not do that. I already turned that off. I won't do some research. Do I have more than one pump? Let's... No one's going to want to go down here, here, but you know what? Let's just disable that. I just don't want my circuit to overload. Uh... Let's turn off our second, or another electrolyzer. We'll just run the one, temporarily. I think we're safe with all of that. Okay, and I'll probably stop pro processing eggs for a time as well, but I think supply is done enough. All right, so there goes scientist. Let's look in this. It says in use, assigned to scientist. I'm wondering if it's going to describe for me how long this will take. It doesn't. I'm, I'll go on the website, I'll find that out, and I'll be right back. So, anyone that has the Minitronic skill, I suggest giving them a priority of building, which is actually the opposite of uh, what scientists had there. Because I'm getting everyone else to focus on other things while Builder builds. That's why I wanted Builder to actually have this skill. Scientist is doing a good job though. There's nothing wrong with with what I'm seeing. This is slow mode actually. Slow speed. We may have some eggs to process. But I really, 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 really um, want to get this automation in. This is kind of more for myself, to be honest. As in, if I couldn't do it, if I just didn't have the metal, I would still be able to get the carnivore achievement with what I had. But uh, given the fact that I had a metal refinery to create this aluminum, I, I'm not losing any in the translation from aluminum ore to aluminum. So I don't feel bad about using some material. And I can always destroy it after. Let's say I get the carnivore achievement. I could destroy the sweeper. I could destroy the uh, conveyor loader. I have not even a ton of aluminum. Well, that's aluminum. Aluminum ore. I've got one and a half tons. It's a little bit left in the world. This is You're looking at this. Uh, you're looking at a pe couple pe uh, pe ugh, excuse me, pieces down here. There's obviously uranium ore. A good amount of it, actually, quite a bit. But, um, yeah, getting to space and going to other rockets, I don't even know. I'm just not there. That's going to be interesting. I'm just not there. I'm just focused on this room and surviving, building the things that I need to do to get the achievement, get to the dupes to not die. That was, amongst everything else, I have a policy of no dupe gets left behind. Except for the mission where a dupe goes somewhere off in space. Apart from that, which is them not dying, they just go to, well, who knows where they go, but they go where they go. Um, let's speed this up a little bit. I'm going to check on Builder. Let's click on them. You can go, oh, that's a ladder, not a Builder. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to confuse the two of you. So, stress. Where are they going? Their stress is going up. They have high morale. They're sopping wet. Um, and that's why they're... And that'll last. Can I get information on... Uh, oh, no, that's the morale. I was hoping to be able to see how long, when that would run off. 
that's most likely because I had them disabled it. Uh, I'm s that. Well, it may not be Builder that does this. I want to re-enable this. This is one of the machines that I turned off. Though, do we really need that if... Yeah, that's a low amount of liquid. We kind of, yeah. Sorry, whoever whoever's going to do that, you're going to be upset for, for a while. But I think Builder's going to be fine, stress-wise. Because, yeah, they uh, are going to get that... They're, they're currently wet. They'll dry out, and they'll stop going down in that area. Scientist, I'm hope. Yeah, there you are. Hope you get busy building this. In fact, you might be able to multitask. I'll make this two things to build right there. Realize too that I could actually destroy that. That's made out of copper ore. Hey. Some free copper ore in the world. Not, uh, not that it's that much, but it's there. Not gonna accept any dupes. And just a little bit more to build. First setting here is I'm gonna specify I want all eggs. Well, there's no, uh, let's see, critter eggs, critter eggs. I'm gonna say sweep only, that's important. So I can now select eggs that do not have the little by effect, such as that one, such as this one. And that'll bring them up here to be processed, along with the new ones. Now I'll just wait for scientists to build some of this stuff and I'll be back, because they're going to the washroom. So this room is nearly complete. All I need is a tile to be built there. I'll specify that any of the pips or the pip morphs can be dropped up here. I'll have, I'll take four of them. It's overloading it a little, ah, uh, uh, no, 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 no. Let's just do one for now at, at very high priority. The goal is that as a, a seed is in there, let's dump this out. All I want, and let's take those. And let's, let's actually get them out of there, because do I have a free bin? I'll just put the I'll just put it up there, because I want to encourage the pip that I'm going to put here to put it put it in one of these spots. Is the nature reserve ahead going to give an issue? One, two, three, four. Let's. Uh, oh man. I have to do. I have to do some research. Hold on. believe this is how this is going to work. A tree, let's say the pip tries to plant it there. In the up direction, there cannot be more than two other plants. So one, two, three, four, five. That's kind of a problem. Ah. Uh, so obviously there's, there's like four in this area. I think these ones are fine, but that sh that would be okay because this would still be a nature reserve as long as there's four plants. They can all go. And you know what? If I really wanted something to be replanted, it's easy. I mean, I just bring a pip down. There are tons of pips in this world. Tons of pipped eggs. Not really going to have an issue. Scientists, I'm really hoping that, uh, yeah, you're going in there and working on it. Good stuff. Glad to see the rest of the dupes can work on this area. And now it's time to wrangle one of these pips. It should be an adult. 
so that they can actually pick or uh, plant some opportunity for meat. Scientists don't attack. I'd rather have you building. So build, are you bringing down a... No, oh, you're doing the plant. That's fine. That's fine. This is a priority nine dupes. Of course, uh, a pip has to be wrangled first. Da -da 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 -da. So, okay. Please don't touch that. Please... Don't touch that. Actually, if they dig, if they plant it there, that's okay. I can dig that out. But should have done this before the pip went in. Though it, that's fine. Let's put it here at high priority and just hope that the pip is gonna. Hey, good. Yes, you can. Okay, we're good. So in time, that that this pip will pick up the acorn and drop it there. Let's see, uh, scientist is almost done. I think there's just this last piece of equipment. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go. Go, 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 go. Oh, this is painful to watch. I want it so much. So probably all these, hey, I'm almost certain it's been more than a cycle, so everything needs to be reprocessed. Mark that as such. And here is the automation running. Taking in, so auto sweeper. Taking all the eggs. And it's gonna be bringing it up into the conveyor loader and dropping it into this room. I'm gonna shut this down. I'm gonna remove all of this mess. Let's see. Yeah, it can literally all go, all gone. Except for automation for lights and power. This thing can go. This thing can go. That little circuitry that I had before that was just a, for the fake out uh, manual generator, it can go. So this is gonna be for all critter eggs. Just see a critter egg, just put it down there. So this one here, which unfortunately, um, kinda don't want that, but it's a one-time thing, cause all new eggs are dropped there. We'll see, now I'm gonna say, Hatch egg can be incubated. Supply should be on their way. That's a high priority building item. All kinds of stuff is being teared down. Actually, that's not neat. I'm getting all this metal back. Happy about that. Supply is going to store some food. Dun, dun, dun. Now I assume you're gonna go to the hatchery. Nope. I said hatchery. Oh, okay. That's why you're not going in there. I'm gonna get you to go directly there now. So you're gonna hug an egg, and this is how this is gonna work. So the hug this egg. I can remove it. The auto sweeper is gonna pick it up. I can say do another one as long as there's an egg somewhere in this world. Oh, they're just having some fun destroying a lamp. That's fine. Scientist is putting it in there. Now, scientist, you're not trapped in there, are you? you no, know, you're actually just properly out of things to do. Tree has been planted. That is awesome news. I'm gonna go plan some activities for the dupes to do and go get back to this. So this will be a next episode project. But what I'm gonna do is get the dupes to carve out a spot over here to grow lettuce. I'll need bleachstone for that. So just while I work with supply and figure out that. Let's just do some digging in and around here. To, to, to be careful that they're not going to drop this water on them. That'll be fine. So at least the dupes won't be idle. Well, let's continue. Uh, why, why not dig out to this thing? And somewhere around this area, I'll have to be careful, this liquid that it drains down this way. We'll have a farm for lettuce. That's going to be next episode. 
Uh, the other bit, if you're just also looking for, oh no, let's make that the priority. And let's get back to this, slow it down. So that's probably, no, this isn't. Uh, okay, so here's what's happened. Supplies over here. The machine is off. If I, uh, I could either make this room smaller or, or just to hope that supply never sort of walks away. We'll see if this becomes a problem. I'll just leave it as it is. Or I'll just remove that automation and just have it on all the time. Because I know that I'm not gonna... I've never accidentally left an egg in there and wasted power from that perspective. So Auto Sweeper picks it up, drops it off. This is slow mode. I'm gonna speed it up here in a second. Then I can select another egg to be processed. They give it a hug. I can't do anything wrong. I don't, it doesn't matter if I'm late at removing this egg. It doesn't matter. Because, uh, it, it'll, it'll just be swept out of the way. Otherwise, you know, the uh, process I had before with the door, I, I had, uh, it was all based on timing. No. This is going to allow me to go through all of these at the same time. Here's what I can do. I can specify the eggs that don't have the lullaby effect. Boom, that's this one. That's this one. And uh, this one, that's enough for now. This machine is gonna bring it up for me to be processed. I can do another pip egg. And we're just gonna be punching out, well this, well, this part of this is gonna be the, well, meal wood, but uh, barbecue 6,000 calories, meal, meal lice 22,000. Um, question whether we actually need all that much lettuce, though. I'd rather grow a small amount of lettuce to top up the few dupes that aren't able to eat meat each cycle. The goal isn't to get every single dupe to eat, be able to eat barbecue meat. Eventually they will, but I mean as far as the carnivore achievement is concerned. I just need 400,000 consumed in total amongst all the dupes. And this is helping out a lot. More my sanity than anything else, but I just am enjoying this so much more. Um, it does allow me to do this more efficiently. I'm actually able to get a little bit more eggs through per cycle because bringing them up isn't a manual process that involves a dupe. The dupe doesn't have to waste any time doing that. So this is awesome. All right, I think uh, I can go. Is there any actually stone a uh, stone hatching? We can do that one. That's a good, more difficult to uh, attack those ones, but it is more meat. Okay, so that will do for this episode. If, oh, let's before I forget, let's supply out. Let's do a health check here. I'm feeling really good uh, because this is so much more uh, delightful to work with. Oxygen, we're doing good. I did remember to turn these back on. Power, really nothing has changed, though I did remember when I'm using this machine to turn other things off and didn't have any circuitry issues. Heat, concerned about the fridge. It's uh, 60 degrees chlorine. Uh, also, a bit of heat down here, so that is one project to look at, base cooling insulation. I want to grow some uh, lettuce in this area. I need at least 22 degrees for that. There's nowhere in my, well, that's exactly, actually I was going to say nowhere is uh, below that. It's 20, I lied, 21 point something. Uh, well, obviously, bottom of the base would be a bad place to grow it, but. So yeah, I mean, I chose, I'm going to choose that location. Let's look at our water lines. We've got our water system that converges here, prioritizes on waters from the geyser versus this cache. This cache, I should probably see 717. I'm gonna see if that ever actually goes down. Hoping it won't. Plus the polluted water and salt water lines going in. The pollutant line is just going to this guy here, metal refinery. And then down here, that's being converted to water at that point. What else? Germs. Yeah, looking healthy that way. 
And on the wild plant situation, wild meal, wood, whatever, but I've got this tree. Now this pip isn't gonna be happy. There, they will get hungry. Let's disable this uh, temporarily. But once this grows in 18 cycles, I'll put three pips there and we'll just get even more meat per cycle once that is the case. I don't think there's any point putting pips in there right now if they're just gonna go hungry. Uh, what else? Du, 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 du. Back to this, the rooms. We have, what well, we have new pip staples. So how big is 78 titles? Yeah, that is gonna be fine. Career starvation, is that that pip? No, it's this pip. Yeah, I am overloading this. Um, would love to get more acorns. That's a limiting factor for me for producing meat, really. I mean, I could push the hatches more, but I'm gonna get the carnivore achievement. I'm, I'm comfortable with, uh, with the plan so far. Speaking of which, let's end on looking at the colony summary. Do I have any achievement? Have not earned any achievements? Haven't really tried to. I'm just working on the carnivore. And I have 132,000 now, meaning 400,000. Thanks for watching. I'm quite excited. I've got uh, much better automation now that Minitronics Engineering, and I've got my conveyor loader. It's the start of this cycle, so I'm going to pause it because, oh, there's a stone hatch. There's probably some eggs I need to, uh, to process, and I don't want to waste a second doing that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in a future video.